Where are you? Oh, you're in the laundry basket. Good morning, guys. It is Sunday. Um, it's about noon actually, so it's not really morning anymore. I slept in late and then me and the dog just went out and we played some fetch and kind of like read some internet stuff. And yeah, now I'm going to go and get washed and dressed and then I'm just going to go hard on the cleaning. So hopefully it all goes well. <laughs> okay, so um, I took a shower. Um, I didn't wash my hair, but you know, it's all good. And threw my hair in a ponytail and threw on just a little bit of makeup. This is what I'm wearing. It's just a black romper. It's just nice out and I didn't feel like dealing with the dress and this is really comfy and it has pockets, so yay. Basically, I feel like I'm in pajamas. Um, I started doing a little bit of cleaning, so I tidied parts of the bathroom and I've just been kind of tackling my makeup situation. So yeah, I'm just gonna push on with the cleaning and try to get as much done as I can. Um, I've been listening to like a summer playlist on Spotify. So it's just been like getting me in the summery mood and energized and yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited to have a clean house. So excited. <laughs> Okay, so I thought I'd show you where we're at right now. Still have quite a bit to do, but it's getting better. Makeup has all been put away. Bedroom, surfaces are getting cleared. All of the dishes have been taken to um, my sink, which I almost called a dish pit. <laughs> Still need to clean up this. Um, bathroom has been tidied. I haven't cleaned anything yet. This has all just been tidying. I haven't wiped anything down. Um, these are dirty clothes that didn't fit into the wash that is on. There's a wash on. This is all tidied. Um, I took out the trash, cleaned all the trash. Then this one I haven't done as much work on, but I have started just collecting things and compiling them. I have to tackle this area. It's like the next big thing. Um, dishes are all just spread out because there's a load on right now. So yeah, we're, we're getting there. I got, you know, a, the big stuff out of the way. So when I clean, I tend to clean in like big, bursts, you know, because I'm not great at cleaning on like as I go. Um, so one of the things I do when cleaning is really overwhelming is I start with um, laundry, trash, and dishes. Because um, once you clear away all your laundry, all your trash, all your dishes, it always looks so much better. Um, but I'm so hungry right now. It's two o'clock, I haven't eaten anything yet today. So I'm gonna go grab some food. I'm gonna go to Subway, because it's Sunday, Subway Sunday. And also it just sounds really, really good. Um, and then I'm gonna come back and finish this cleaning. Yes, um, so psyched to be getting this place clean. I, ever since like, oh my gosh, I just, I, I signed all of the paperwork for my apartment so far. I'd have gotten like deposits and stuff down and it's just like giving me so much energy. I'm just like, yes, yes, I am so psyched. I'm psyched to move, I'm psyched to redecorate. I'm psyched, I think moving and like packing my stuff up is gonna give me um, ample opportunity to declutter some more because um, I had decluttered quite a bit of stuff but then I wanted to declutter and there was cleaning involved and things were staying messy because I wanted to declutter so I'm gonna declutter as I pack um, especially like my art stuff and the rest of my clothes well I did declutter some bras today I have I had like six bras that don't fit me anymore I was like these are all too small <laughs> like so I put those in the bag that I have that's like clothes that I'm getting rid of I, I, I need to sort through it and like figure out what ones are going thrown away and what stuff's going to Goodwill and what stuff I'm trying to sell. So I've just been like throwing it all in there. But anyway, super, super hungry. I'm going to Subway, so excited. And I think I'm gonna, might like eat my Subway outside or in the Subway and like bring my book and do some reading. Okay, so I have my Subway and I am sitting outside on that bench um, to eat it and read. And I thought about grabbing the dog and bringing the dog out here with me as well but I just felt like juggling food and her leash was just gonna be way too much. <laughs> um, 
but I'm super excited because when I was in the line for Subway, there was this um, little advertisement that said like, oh, text this number for um, coupons, and I love text message coupons, they're like my favorite form of coupons. So <laughs> I um, texted the number, and the board had said that you could get a free sub with a purchase of a 30 ounce drink, which is what I normally get for a six inch. So I got my sandwich for free, so I spent two dollars, so hey! Um, so yeah, uh, oh, it's 79 degrees out. It is so nice. There was just like a little mini tornado of dust and I totally missed it. I was trying to get it, but I, I don't think I did. I'm so happy right now. I was just, oh my God. Okay, so there's this character I have been hardcore shipping the main character with for like two books now. And she keeps being like, he's my Fred, but you can totally tell that like, she's like in love with him. And I know, I knew that the character got remarried uh, later on in her life, but um, I didn't know if it was to him they totally just like confess their love for each other in like a very practical way and I just like I can't I just want to cry it's just so perfect and amazing and I'm so happy right now well so it's just coming up to five I just finished everything is tidied and I wiped and swept and mopped the floors I still have a couple things left to do um I need to put on a second load that second load of dishes still the first is just drying I also need to put my bedding on to wash. I stripped my bed, um, but I need to put away some laundry so I can take the laundry out of the dryer so I can move the laundry that's in the washer into the dryer so I can wash my bedding. Um, so I still have a couple things left to do, but I'm pretty much done with like the big chunk of it, which is super good. Um, I'm just taking a quick break uh, to have a drink, some soda here, and um, just kind of like just take a break um and then i think i will get at least enough laundry done like put away so that i can put my bedding in the wash and then i think i'll edit the vlog and continue with everything after editing the vlog because i don't want the vlog to go up too terribly late um but yeah i am happy so far with everything that has gotten done i'm glad that my apartment is clean again um it's still like a little disorganized and messy but that's just because i you know i really want to sit down and like reorganize everything so everything feels disorganized but uh, I don't really have anything else to say do you have anything to say no okay say that I am done with cleaning for the day um, I did put away that laundry um, there is like another thing of laundry in the dryer right now but I'll probably just throw that in a um, laundry basket and not put it away yet um, I have just did, done the dishes and I've been watching oh and I wiped down I didn't do like a full deep clean or anything like that but like I wiped down surfaces and countertops and stuff like that I've been watching a bunch of the Taylor videos. I think that's how I, you pronounce it, the Taylor. So she was like on Twitter the other day and someone was like asking her about her tips for starting a YouTube channel. She was like, she has a name that people can pronounce. Um, but anyway, uh, I just got an insane amount of ideas for YouTube videos, um, like, like a bunch of ideas. Like, and so I need to go write those down in my document and then I actually might even film but I need to go to the dollar store and buy more nail polish remover because I'm totally out and my nails are super chipped. 
So I think I'm gonna write those ideas down, run to get some nail polish remover, and then potentially start filming. I just, I don't know, I just had so many ideas just inspired by, like I'm really, I, I really like the beauty community on YouTube. So I find it interesting to look at beauty videos and try to figure out like how I can um, do that as an art video or like, what things I can do and also this is good because I want to film the dollar store challenge because I do have the cheap art challenge but I have two more challenges that I want to do one of them is just a dollar store challenge like everything from the dollar store so if I take last time I was at the dollar store didn't have my vlog camera so I'm gonna bring this camera and film that like kind of um process because I want to film a little bit of the shopping process like uh for that video so oh my gosh yay this is great I am I am feeling really good. Like, I kind of feel like I can feel my slump breaking. And I don't know if it's a combination of the weather being so nice. I am always so, so much happier when it is warm out. Um, it's just, I, I get really bad seasonal affective disorder. I think that's what it's called, or seasonal affective depression, sad, whatever it is. Um, and I, I don't know, but, or, or if it's just that like, I have broken through it, like making the bell video, or if um, I just like the idea of all of this change, you know, like moving and cleaning the apartment is just like spurring me, but I am feeling really good and really excited and I'm really happy about it. I'm going to the Dallas store, I'm going to the Dallas store, going to the Dallas store, yeah, whoop, whoop, whoop. I have so much energy right now. Okay, so I just left Dollar Tree. I got everything for the dollar store art challenge. It's gonna be interesting. Um, I was able to find watercolors and watercolor paper. Um, the brushes situation is looking pretty grim, but I actually did manage to pick up some cute makeup brushes um, that I think might work or might help out. Um, I also got some like acrylic paint and some colored pencils because I have the feeling they may be necessary to help clean things up. I did also get white out to use for like white highlights. So, you know, thinking ahead. Um, but I am going to run if I can find my car. I think I parked in this one. I'm going to run to Family Dollar now because Dollar Tree didn't have acetone. They only had nail polish remover and I want pure acetone. It's just so much easier to clean up your nails with. Oh, I did get a bunch of stuff for myself though. They had these like Revlon perfumery nail polishes and they had some really, really pretty colors. So I picked up three of those and also some like nail art things. Um, they're like little fruits. I think I might use them right now. I don't know. So I'm home and I thought I would do a little haul of everything I got except for the art, the Dollar Tree art challenge stuff. I'm not going to show you that. So from Family Dollar, I got a pizza because I was so hungry. Like the air outside smelled so good. Like it smelled like I don't know, but like outside in that plaza smelled like like really nice burgers, like gourmet burgers, which is kind of what I want, but pizza seemed like a good option. And I was just like, I don't want to think for dinner tonight. Like, I don't want to have to think. I just want food. So this is what we're doing. Although I just realized that my pizza cutter is currently like actively in the dishwasher right now. And it takes so long for my dishwasher. So I might have to cut this with a knife. Um, so I got that. I got a soda, Coke Zero, and I have this really bad craving for gummy candy right now, so I got gummy bears. It's not exactly what I wanted, but I'm hoping that it will like curb that craving. And then I also, oh, I also got a pink hamburger. Um, I also got from Family Dollar Acetone, nail polish remover 100% acetone. This is a really big bottle, which is nice. And then I got this nail polish. Um, just because I saw it and I thought it was like the prettiest color I've ever seen. It's looking more brown on camera, but it's actually got a kind of rosy tint in real life. Um, so add just like a tiny little bit of red to this, but it's like a warm neutral and I just think it's going to be so pretty and I'm super excited about it. They actually had like a whole line of this stuff and you're supposed to use the top coat with it for it to like color last its 10 days, but I'm, I didn't buy the top coat because I have a quick dry top coat that I use. Um, but all of the colors in this uh, line were really pretty. Like I wanted them on, they were only $2. So then from the Dollar Tree, 
when I was trying to satisfy the gummy craving, I got these. I didn't really want them, but then I felt bad about telling her that I didn't want them by the time that I got there, so I just bought them. So I'll probably eat them at some point. And then, like I said, I got nail polish and like nail art stuff. I'm just gonna like, hey, okay. So I got three of these Revlon nail polishes. I got this one in Powder Puff, which is pale pink and it has like glitter. And then I got this one in Italian leather, which looks like a gray brown with like a um, gold tint. It looks like it needs to be shaken up, so the color may vary a little bit, but it looks pretty. And then I got this one in Spun Sugar, which is like a silvery, taupey kind of gold color. I don't know, it's really pretty. Um, so all like unique colors. Then I got this, which are these like little nail art slices. There's like watermelons. There's these ones. I really like these white ones. These are super cute. These are like lemons. Um, they just have like some, it was just like, I just thought they were really pretty. So I got those there. All of them were like kind of fallen out, but I might use these. I might use this with the, this color. Cause even though I love all these colors, like, I don't know why, but like this color is the one I'm just so drawn to right now. I also got this nail polish corrector pen to help, not really to like clean up my actual nail because I, I use a brush in acetone, but I thought it would be really good for when I do a gradient and I get nail polish all over my skin just to clean that off really quickly. And then I got a nail buffer because I have been needing a nail buffer for a while, mine is dead. Oh my God, yes! The dishwasher just stopped and started drying. Everything's coming up, Alice! So I think the plan is, um, since I'm pretty much done cleaning, the only thing I have left to do is make my bed. I'm just about to move that uh, laundry to the dryer, um, my bedding to the dryer. But I'm going, I started preheating the oven. I'm gonna cook food slash make food, like eat food. Um, and I'm gonna deal with my nails during that. And then it, depending on the time, I may film a video. If I do film a video tonight, it's gonna be a chat and sketch kind of video. Um, but I may just film that tomorrow. I do want to film two videos this week. That is something that is a priority, but they may be two smaller videos. Um, so yeah, we're gonna, I'm gonna see like kind of what time it is by the time I finish eating and doing my nails and stuff like that. But either way, the, my nails will be done for filming either tonight or tomorrow, so. Oh, and I need to edit the vlog. that was in um, the dryer. I wasn't going to, but then I just thought it would probably be a lot faster and easier if I just like sorted it out, folded it, put it on hangers and stuff as I pulled it out of the dryer. Um, so that's what I did and then I already did that so I might as well just put it away. And I actually put on another load. Um, I probably won't put that one away tonight, although it will go in the dryer because I figure what's in the dryer right now is for sure gonna get put away because it is my bedding. Um, and a bunch of my like favorite clothes were at the bottom of my laundry basket. I've been like wondering where they are, but like all my favorite leggings have been at the bottom of the laundry basket and like some of my favorite tank tops and like comfy clothes. And I'm just like, where are you? Oh, you're in the laundry basket. This pizza is like giving me life. I'm so excited. Like, do I just reply and be like, hi, the Euro you bought me almost killed me. Yes, I would totally say that. <laughs> be like fun fact. That Euro sent me to the ER. Look who's here, it's my sister. She Again. St she stopped by on her way to Fort Collins because she left her stuffed animal here. Look, yeah, she's peeping over. Yeah, which is good because she actually got her right as my pizza finished at uh, the oven, so she's gonna help me eat some of it because I can't eat all of it. And I don't like to waste pizza. Hi, yes, I... Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I just went on Etsy to look at bumper stickers um, because I'm getting my mom's old car, so my new car, on Thursday. And um, 
I saw that my revenue was uh, there was there was numbers in it and I was like huh? and I was like what and then I was like shit did somebody buy my painting and I like didn't notice but somebody bought it two hours ago they bought my palm oil painting so yay I can I got I was oh I'm just so excited and I can donate that money and oh yay I was hadn't sold yet so I'm really happy that somebody bought it oh my gosh angle because my camera died so it is plugged in right now I just painted my nails December hun they look like this it's like that color and then I put one of the little gems on my thumb focus there we go I'm not 100% sure if I love them I seriously I struggled so much oh December I love you I can't pet you because my nails are wet um <laughs> I struggled so much painting my nails like seriously, I just, I don't know why. I was just like getting nail polish everywhere and the nail polish was like being weird and my like top coat was being weird and I kept like hitting my nails against things and like, like getting dents and scrapes and stuff in them. And it was just <laughs> a little bit ridiculous like how much I struggled, um, but whatever. Um, I didn't wrap the tips because it was like a big brush and I was like kind of having a hard time controlling it Even though normally I like wider brushes. So these probably won't last more than like a day or two, but you know They're fun and they should be there at least for filming tomorrow. So Okay, so I just made my bed it looks so nice and neat I'm getting a new bed and it's a queen size bed and I just got this new bedding and I'm hoping to like the comforter duvet will still work and I'll just have to rebuy new ones of these because I actually have three like I have two duvet covers and one like quilt that I really really love um that I don't want to have to get rid of um but queens aren't that much bigger than foals I think um so hopefully I can still use it um even though I just bought these and I don't want to replace them I don't think the fitted sheet will work but anyway that is made um, so I am gonna head to sleep. I'm so tired, so I'm just gonna go wash off my makeup and uh, I might do a little bit of reading, but I have work tomorrow morning. Ugh, the weekend is over already. Rip weekend. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye vlog. Bye.